What's new in the UN Digital Library? We have added some exciting new features to the UN Digital Library to help you with your searches. Let's get started by visiting the Digital Library website at digitallibrary.un.org. Filters. In our first example, we will do a keyword search. Type in your keywords. We chose official holidays. Then filter your results by resource type, UN body, or by date. Watch how the results narrow down to the two most recent records. Filtering is a helpful feature to limit broad keyword searches to find specific documents. Full text search. Let's say you want to find all mentions of a specific term. We found 11 records for the global service delivery model. Now turn on full text search to cast the widest possible net. Watch how the results change from 11 to 315 records. Let's say you want to find mentions of Budapest within this search. Add Budapest into the search box and click search. This time, we've narrowed down your search to 15 records. Let's open the 51st report and search for Budapest. You can see that the term was found four times in the report. Linked record. Related documents are now linked on the same document page, so it's easier to find relevant information. In our example, we're using Resolution 256 from the 72nd General Assembly. Click on the record. When the document page displays, scroll down to the bottom. Here, you can view related documents like the draft resolution, the committee report, and the meeting record. Speeches. If you need to find the speech by country or topic, click on Speeches underneath the main search box. From the search page, click on Advanced Search. Enter the member state into the first search box and choose Country slash Organization from the drop-down list. The Digital Library found 2,571 speeches by German speakers. Now you can filter again based on your preferences. We want to filter by subject. Migrant workers. And found 13 documents. Let's choose the second speech from the top. Open the meeting record and search for the speaker, Mr. Rowland, who can be found on page 8. That's all. We hope you will find these new features as useful as we do.